All right, guys, welcome back to lesson two, episode two, whatever you want to call it. Um, obviously, this looks a little bit bland, uh, the theme of our slave hack, so we are just going to quickly uh, change the theme here. And I believe we can go to, uh, let's see here, where is it? Theme, right here. And uh, we'll go to the gallery. And uh, I like the, um, the obviously, the number one that has uh, been downloaded is Born Live Die. Uh, he's been playing for a very, very, very long time. Uh, however, I like uh, Jesse's, uh, uh, Jesse's theme here. Uh, it's just a little bit nicer. So, okay. And uh, this is now asking us to uh, join a faction. So let's go ahead and join a faction real quick. Um, and we've joined the white hack faction, so, all right, wonderful. So now that we've joined a faction, we are all good there. Uh, and actually that didn't even change. Let's change to uh, born live dies because it makes it like a little bit cooler. All right, wonderful. So we'll close that out. Now here's our terminal. Uh, the first thing that we want to do is get some software. As you can see, um, our software absolutely stinks. Um, we have a water wall with a level of uh, 0.1. We have a firewall of 0.1. We have a pulse sensor of 0.1, and we have um, obviously our nudes. Now the nudes, you definitely want to back these up immediately, right now. So let's go ahead and do that because if somebody else has your nudes, then that sucks. So uh, what we're going to do is type in NAS, and NAS stands for Network Attached Storage, or also your external hard drive here. Um, so we're going to type in NAS, and we're going to back up, and we're going to put a name flag there, and we are going to put um, just uh, DJ Red, and that will actually be sufficient enough to start moving over um, our nudes. And it says right here, uh, it's got two seconds, zero seconds, awesome and then we just go ahead and click on this little green uh, button right here and we have successfully moved them over to our external hard drive but that's not just enough what we want to do is remove them from our hard drive so we'll use the remove command which is rm and then we will just type in dj red because that's my name and we are going to remove those nudes uh, obviously it takes a little bit of time because we haven't updated our uh, CPU. Uh, once you upgrade your CPU, uh, the, remove task, uh, the remove task will go a lot quicker. So three, two, one, and there we go. We have successfully removed them from our hard drive. Now nobody has access to them whatsoever. Okay, so let's worry about uh, getting uh, some better uh, uh, some better uh, software and um, let's first of all uh, go ahead and do some missions so we'll keep the terminal window open um, and we are going to need a couple of things down here on our uh, taskbar so the first thing that I always like to put is uh, my computer let's open that up the second thing is finances we will also bring up slaves we will bring up gateway we'll bring up missions and what we'll do is we'll right click on our my computer and we'll pin every single one of these my computer finances slave list gateway and we'll also pin the missions now let's go ahead and get rid of these windows because we don't need them open right now and we will also open up inventory and forge and we'll leave the chat closed for now because that's not really important uh, and that is, yep, that's all we need. All right, cool. So we'll also pin these two as well. That's the inventory and that's the forge. We'll get rid of those. And the first thing that we're going to do um, is get some new uh, missions. So obviously you start out with um, some low level missions here, and then we move up further and further to higher level missions. Um, and you can check your level by going onto your my computer and checking out slave um, that's obviously level one as you can see level one this is prestige this is a prestige level and uh, after every 50 levels that you get uh, your prestige goes up and it resets back to level one that's automatic and it cannot be uh, uh, 
uh, stopped in any way. So um, the higher prestige you are, the higher level you are, the bigger the software levels that you can use. So let's go ahead and do some missions. We'll accept these five missions here. And what we need to do is uh, delete single files off of each one of these servers. Okay, so we're going to need our logs window open. And we'll get rid of these uh, logs here just by clicking that red button. And we can also resize these windows too, uh, which is really, really nice. So I like to put my terminal down in the bottom. And I like to put my logs window right about here. Uh, make that just a little bit smaller. Awesome. And make it... There we go. Perfect. And now we have our missions that we have to do. So uh, the target is this IP address. So let's copy that IP address and go ahead and connect to it. Uh, and then once we use the SSH command, if we don't have the password for it already, what we'll have to do is crack it. So we can just type in uh, hack and then the IP address. And then it'll crack the password. Again, this process is going to be increasing uh, once you get your CPU uh, upgraded, etc. So go ahead and click that green. Now the slave has been added. And if you look at your, whoops, not the my computer. If you look at your slaves list here, uh, this server, the 136.21.254.59, that is actually Twitter, and that's the password for it. Obviously, we don't need this window this big. Uh, so let's try and uh, minimize it here just a little bit. All right, cool. We'll put this down at the bottom, and now we can go ahead and SSH into it or connect to it. So let's type in SSH. We'll get rid of our log there. We'll get rid of our log there. Now we are deleting the uh, 03F363C3 uh, file. Now you can take a look at all the files that are on a server by typing in ls. And as you can see, here's the zip file right here. Um, somebody installed a miner, um, and I'll explain more later on what that is. Um, and then there's some other uh, books and stuff like that. The books you do not need. Zip files you do not need. All you don't have to download them whatsoever. Um, you can go ahead and just install or uh, delete them. So you can type in uh, rm03 uh, in order to delete it. Uh, but what I like to do is create an alias. So we'll just type in alias, um, and I like to use just the letter D, and then that's going to be for the remove command. And then we'll also create an alias uh, DID, which is uh, the remove ID command. So uh, let's go ahead and just uh, type in D03, and it'll start removing this. As you can tell, this is going to take a while to do. So uh, let's try and look at our gateway, see if we can upgrade some things. As you can tell, uh, it's going to be a little bit slow going at first. We need $3,341.50 to upgrade our CPU. Um, the first thing that you definitely want to start upgrading is your CPU. Um, but once your CPU gets into a good level and your hard drive and your network gets into a good level, um, then you really want to uh, focus on your external hard drive. The external hard drive if somebody hacks you, they cannot access the external hard drive whatsoever at all. So uh, I definitely would suggest taking um, a lot of your time upgrading your external hard drive first. Uh, that's probably the number one thing, then CPU, uh, then network, and then hard drive last. Uh, hard drive is really easy to upgrade. Um, if you would like to get the tracer, you can. Um, it's not necessary. Um, it, does, it really hasn't helped me throughout the game. So uh, definitely, um, you know, start out by, you know, doing your missions. And then as soon as this is done, we will come right back and I will show you how to complete your very first mission. <music> All right, so uh, this has now completed, so we'll go ahead and click this green button right here, and that will actually uh, remove the file. But as soon as we click this button, a log will be created in both our remote logs and local logs, and we want to remove those as quickly as possible. So click on remove, 
and click these little red icons here and that is good to go. So now that we've deleted this file, this mission is now complete. We can hit the green checkbox and that will give us some re reputation and some money. Um, as you can see, we made $189 by completing the mission and 183 reputation. So your goal uh, it, for the next little while is to uh, s complete as many single file delete missions as you possibly can. Uh, and then we'll move on into episode three. Um, so this is just getting you started. Episode three, uh, we'll start upgrading uh, our, our uh, hardware and uh, learning a little bit more about different missions and stuff like that. So uh, stay tuned for the next video and thanks for tuning in.